Hello YouTube, this is Wyatt here at Main Meadow Sanctuary. Just gonna give you guys a quick tour of our property now, it's, time, it's daytime. You see back there, that's where we come in. About half a mile easement into the property. And we come around here and then we're officially entering our property. In order to get the Jerkison 16 by 50 prefab shed cabin, we're gonna need to clear this 18 feet. Right now, about an eight foot road, so we're gonna need to double the size. We started clearing in some spots, but we're gonna be working on that for the next couple weeks. But we need to get going because we're gonna get a well drilled next week and they need the height level cleared on all these branches up here. Here's Sun Nance, helping me do the morning rounds. Eventually the plan is to build eco shelters in all of this and start having retreats. Maybe have a hidden hot tub or two somewhere out there. Now we're coming up on our, the main part of our property where we're building our house. Now this is where our homestead is going to be. Currently we're set up in our Class C RV that over the past year we've lived in for two months. Went to over 40 states. Seen it all. Oh, trip there a little bit. And we decided to settle here in Oklahoma. Here's just, I'll show you guys this. This is a Power Mate 3500 that I just bought from Walmart. Just was looking for a cheap generator because we're just, we're gonna be doing solar panels soon. We bought the kit, we just need to find the right batteries for it. This thing has worked well so far. It said 12 hour runtime at 50%. We don't even use that in the, in the RV, so this thing can run for about 15 hours on just 4.5 gallons. Keep some extra gas on hand always. It's beautiful here in the morning. And Sun Ant sure loves it too. Here's gonna be most likely our building site. We got the well marked off up there. The plan is to gravity feed into our house for our sink and tub. As far as toilet goes, we're gonna be going with a composting toilet. The non-electric one, we wanna use it at the min as minimally power as we can. Here is our little pond. Dog sure does enjoy it. We're, our long-term plans for the pond is we're gonna clean it out, clear all the brush, we're gonna lay down sand right down here, make a little beach area. There's an old boat in the woods that we're gonna drag out, clean up, paint, make it into a sandbox for the kids so they can play on it. Then we wanna get a pump into the pond and do a little like rock waterfall to one side once we get it all cleared. That's down the road. Right now we gotta focus on clearing our half a mile easement so we can get the house delivered and get the well truck in here. I'll stay tuned, there's gonna be plenty more. It's gonna be, like I said earlier, it's gonna be a learning experience for you and me. Don't forget to subscribe. We'll see you soon.